What's going on guys? It's your boy Antonio with another video and this is my second time. I was six minutes in and I just kind of died out a little bit and I had to redo the entire video because I feel like if I make any edits or cuts it won't transition well. I mean it might transition well to you guys but I still might not like it and that's going to drive me nuts. I'm so, I was starting to get nervous part in the end. So, uh, I was planning on doing a video this morning when I got off of work and my roommate ended up picking me up and took me home. So I was planning on walking home and doing a video, but that didn't happen. So we're doing a video right now. I am well rested. I just want to say sleep deprivation, insomnia, sucks dick. It, it's not cool. I, I didn't get any sleep yesterday. I got some sleep today when I got off of work, but yesterday, stressful. Panic attacks, stressful. I had a panic attack yesterday when I got into work. And right when the meeting started, I just like walked away and it, 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 it was happening. It was not lovely. It was horrible. Um, anyone who's ever had a panic attack, or an anxiety attack. Y'all know that shit sucks. Man, I, I went in the cooler yesterday. Tried to calm my nerves down. Didn't really do anything. I, I think I got a little bit worse before I got better. But I, I know I'm going to be okay. I know I'm surrounded by a, an enormous amount of positive people around me. At work, in my personal life, at home. And also on YouTube. I didn't check my YouTube comments until I went on to lunch and I just want to say guys, thank you for the overwhelming, yeah, overwhelmingly amount of positivity that you guys have been sending me. You guys have been making me feel very welcomed here in the booktube community and I'm grateful for that. You guys made my night last night when I was reading those comments. I'm still getting comments right now. Like, damn, I'm su I'm surprised. Like, this almost never happens to me. So, I, I I I love it. I love it, guys. I love it. I love it, and I love it. I just want to thank you guys for making my night and just for being you guys. You guys are awesome. You guys have been great to me, and I, I I'm looking forward to getting to know everyone here in the BookTube community. Um, I just want to ask a question to you guys. How many of you booktubers write? I don't know if all booktubers write. I, I'm just going to make that as, I know you guys love reading and discussing books, but how many of you guys write also? How many of you guys have released a book? How many of you guys write creative stories? If so, point, I, I, I want to see your work. I'm always looking for something new to read, and I, I, I'm i down to read anything. I, I'm a little bit older now, so I'm less picky, I guess. Like, I know when I was younger, I, had a, I, I was kind of picky a little bit on what I read. The same thing went for music, too. Like, half the stuff that I listen to now, I would not listen to when I was younger. But here I am now, uh, older, I'm 31 years old, and I, I'm almost into everything now. But I'm always looking for something new to read, especially a genre that I've never uh, read before. So, booktubers, my authors, my writers, if you guys write, or you know someone that's write, that writes and they're not really well known, uh, I would love to read some of your work. And also, I got to ask this question because I said I was going to do a part two, which will happen. Uh, I answered a question from May Reed's uh, booktube uh, newbie tag. So, I want to invite everyone in the booktube community 
that that does anything creative, whether it's writing, whether it's music, whether it's film, whether it's art. I just want to know where you guys got your inspiration from. What's your creative process like? How do you guys? How do you guys? What ticks in your mind that causes your creativity to flow out fluidly? And also another question for you guys, because I've been on when. A few years ago, I was on a uh, writer's message board that I ended up signing up for, and they had a really great community as well, and this was the question that I asked them that I'm going to ask you guys. How do you guys deal with uh, never-ending ideas? That was something I've always struggled with, that I always, I've had too many ideas always had ideas and ideas and more ideas and i didn't know how to deal with them like i'm, I'm always constantly having ideas i want to work on something but then while i'm working on something another idea will pop up and then i'm going to want to do that idea and everything just kind of became a clusterfuck i guess so that's my question to you guys how do you guys deal with the never ending ideas that keep flowing and then you're, it makes it hard for you to concentrate. I have to, I have to go back on that old message board and look up the question on exactly what I said and I'll get back to you guys. But, uh, for now guys, I think my next video will be the part two of the creative process where I actually show you some of my ideas and explain more into detail about my creative process. I'll even show you some of my lyrics too and like what inspired me to write my music because I'm ready. I'm ready to share, I'm ready to share everything with the world and I'll catch you guys later. Tonio signing off. Y'all have, have a great day guys. See you later.